wanted to read you a book that this series of books have really been helping my daughters develop useful tools for them to deal with some of the emotions that they've been experiencing. So today I thought I'd read you The Anxious Ninja and it's by Mary Nin and pictures by Jelena Stupa. Anxious Ninja just needed to make it over the hill to win. He ran and ran until he reached the finish line. First place! Positive Ninja came in second and said, You're going to crush it this weekend at the Ninja Warrior Race. Great job! But that was the problem. When it came to practice, no one could touch Anxious Ninja. He was the best! But when it was time for the actual competition, his hands would get sweaty, his heart would race, and his mind kept thinking about events he couldn't control. What if I lose? Will everyone think I'm a failure? When his mind drifted to winning or losing, his performance would start to sink and his anxiety would cause him to underperform. Gritty Ninja recognized the pattern it's normal to feel anxiety. We all do. When I was training for the Ninja Warrior Triathlon, everyone expected me to win. And do you know what happened? Asked Gritty Ninja. I came in fourth because I let my anxiety affect my performance. Could I win? Would I win? I was thinking about things I couldn't control. But when I learned how to handle my anxiety, I performed better than ever before, said Gritty Ninja. How did you learn to do that? I'll show you. When you get anxious, just remember the three R's method. Recognize when you are thinking about situations you can't control. Relax by taking a few slow, deep breaths and refocus with positive mantras like everything will be okay as long as I try my best. That weekend at the competition, Anxious Ninja lined up with the other runners. He had one goal in mind. His focus was at an all-time high. And when the gun blasted signaling the start of the race, Anxious Ninja felt good. As the race went on, he had a clear lead, but with only two turns of the race to go, his thoughts began to shift to the finish line. My mum and dad are going to be so proud of me, but what if I lose? What will they say? Just then, he could hear other runners catching up to him, and just like that, he lost his lead. He needed to remember what Gritty Ninja taught him, and fast. What was it his friend said? The three R's. Got it. Recognize, relax, and refocus. He recognized he became aware of where his thoughts were. He relaxed by taking several deep breaths. Then he refocused all of his energy on the present and what he could control, his effort. Work hard. Work hard, he repeated to himself. Work hard. He sounded like a broken record, but this was his mantra. And before he knew it, he cleared the finish line. With flying colors. From that day on, Anxious Ninja still experienced anxiety, but the difference was now he knew how to control it, instead of letting it control him. Remembering the three R's could be your secret weapon against anxiety. Recognize, relax, refocus. Thank you for listening. So we're going to link to this book on Amazon below in the description if you would like to purchase it yourself. Thank you.